Oh, okay, there was a day we did a player analysis on the new Luis Diaz um, Fantasy FC card. Now, we're just going to have a look here quickly and um, before we jump into the analysis, just how much do you think it's going to get upgraded? So, Luis Diaz, in his past four Premier League games, has got a goal or an assist. Or he's got one, he's got five and five. So, we definitely think that he'll definitely he'll, he'll, um, get himself a, a goal or an assist, which is very nice. Now, Liverpool are also on hot red form, but they do have a few hard games coming up, I do believe. Well, they've got Man City and then obviously Europa League. Um, so, they probably will win two in there. Uh, and Luis Diaz will be making three appearances, boys, because of the injuries that Liverpool are suffering at the moment. Um, now, they have in their last three Premier... Well, in their last four Premier League games that they, they've won, they've scored more than three goals. They scored four goals against Luton, four goals against Brentford, four goals against Chelsea, and then obviously they only scored three against Burnley. So there's definitely a chance here, boys, if they do get their fixtures right, and they do beat Spa Prague um, with a heavy, you know, four four goals in there, they might get the 11 goals. Um, but we'll give that one the benefit of the doubt. We'll only say that he'll go up three ratings here. 93 Luis Diaz is what we're looking at, which is amazing. We do love that. So let's actually jump into the analysis now. So we've got five for 11, which is very ideal for a winning up. High, medium, four star, four star, five right footed, most explosive. I'm a bit surprised that they haven't given him five star skills. But nonetheless, we'll move on. You can only play left wing, so he's going to be right footed on that left wing. So if you don't mind an inverted winger, then you know yeah, this card's for you. Uh, and then in terms of linking him, you're going to have to find Liverpool players because you're not going to be able to get a strong link with Colombia and Premier League there. So it could prove a little bit difficult, but it should be okay. So let's actually have a look at these stats then. He looks insane just off the rip. We've got 96 pace, which is amazing. 88 shooting. Uh, and it, it would be much higher. It'd be in the 90s if we didn't have the bad volleys and the bad penalties. And the volleys and penalties don't matter too much, do they really? And the 85 passing, similar things apply with the uh, low free kick actually there. So all's in order there. Same bit of dribbling. Dribbling's amazing there. He's, he's got 81 balance and that's still okay actually. Uh, 77 heading accuracy, which is okay. And then we'll move on to physicality, where you can see everything's in order. Very, very good card, boys. Definitely the best future uh, Fantasy FC I've looked at today. Remember, I'm doing play, analy play analysis on all of them. Um, and he looks really, really good. So we've got six normal play styles, two play style pluses. What are the normal ones? Finesse shot, power shot, long ball pass, rapid flare, trickster. Then we've got technical plus and quick step plus. So he's just going to be really, really fast, boys. Yeah, this guy looks insane, guys. Uh, let's actually have a look at his price. And so 3.45 mil. Um, so if you can find your money, this is probably the best, you know, option, considering he's going to be going up to 93.